Well, we ask you some of the weirdest gifts you've ever received. They're called white elephant gifts mm -hmm. and you guys have responded. Yeah, that's right. So you've been sharing your stories with us all morning about the weird things you've received. Crystal says she got an electric toothbrush that played Justin Bieber songs. That's and not a white elephant gift. That's you a have great one, gift. right? That's yeah, what I have. But she, unlike you, does not have <laughs> Bieber fever. It could get annoying after a while. Beth says she got Santa and Mrs. Claus made out of a milk carton. Oh. Uh, that's okay. A DIY, I guess. I guess so. And Kim says 35 years ago she got a stun gun. What? What? Can you? That what? must have been state of the art 35 <laughs> years ago. What? Is that like? A, I need just, a little oh. more backstory there. Stuns Kim. people like that. Well, if you want to get creative, Ellery McCardle is our gift whisperer. You see it right there. She's whispering, whispering. and she's got a place you can check it all out. So, Ellery, what did you find now? You come up with some amazing things this morning. Guys, I can't find my remote to the TV. Do you know which one it is? Oh, look at that old one. Ah, <laughs> that's awesome. Oh, do you need some stoplights? They got plenty here. <laughs> yes, X-Men surplus. When I think, Eli, I like the hat too. Um, when I think of random, weird, crazy, awesome, X-Men surplus is where I go immediately, especially for those white elephant, those gag gifts. Uh, we're at the location in St. Paul, but they have locations in St. Louis Park and Fridley. Oh, remember last half hour when I found that Northwest Airlines, like, puffy plane? Look what the owner Jim found for me. This is an old cup that says Northwest Airlines on the bottom, and then an old salt shaker too. So they have some old stuff here too, that's really cool. And so let's talk with Jim more because, all right Jim, when I told people at work that I was coming here, they're like, that place is awesome. That's the perfect spot to go. Well, you know, we're trying. We don't, we don't take ourselves too seriously. We're always looking for fun, unique stuff, try to create a different type of shopping experience. And, uh, you know, when the holidays are sort of stressful, you can come in here, find stuff that's cheap and unique, and uh, just have a good time. And a lot of stuff that you were saying earlier, once it's gone, it's gone. That is one of the uh, pitfalls of surplus. You know, here today, gone tomorrow. We, uh, you know, some of the stuff we have in our warehouse, you know, we bought a huge pile of something. But uh, we're always sad when the last one goes out the door because we know we can't replace it. But we're off uh, looking for the new stuff, and that's really exciting. And it must be such a fun job because you never really know what you're going to stumble upon, right? No two days are the same, that's for sure. You know, one day we can be dealing with gear motors, and then next day it's uh, plastic shot glasses or some kind of an alien toy. I love it. Well, thanks so much for having us this morning. Thank you for coming. Yeah, this has been great. Um, I'm going to keep exploring. If you go to my Instagram and you click on my Insta story, I did a live mm -hmm. video and I just went around the aisles and like just looked for you guys. Like, I just, I'm just going to toss it back to you because like I'm just totally. <laughs> what are those? <laughs> nice. She's overwhelmed. Oh, okay. I, like, I don't even know where to go next. Yeah, that's a place you probably <laughs> got to check over yourself to get the full feel. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Too much to see. Love it. Thanks, well, Ellery. Enjoy yourself. We know you do love it. <laughs> <laughs>